Hi there! And isn't it just great that we get to celebrate this week? The fact that the International Accord on Health and Safety in the textile and garment industry is here. It's a reality. And it means that we are going to enter into a, a season now of genuine, genuine accountability for worker safety in, in the garment industry, in the textile industry going forward. Now, I just wanted to take a few minutes to give a bit of the background as to why this stuff takes so long. I've been reading a book, um, I don't know if you see this the right way around or not, it's called Triangle. It was 110 years ago that there was a massive factory fire in New York in the Triangle Garment Factory. That was what put worker health and safety on the map here in the US. And that was after decades of industrial accidents and deaths. So we're here now, eight years after the Rana Plaza tragedy, and we are at a point where this is now beginning to tip into uh, an international awareness. It's not just a local awareness. Now we know that this is an agreement now that is binding for two years that um, the industry is signing up to. But what we also see is that within this, there is a commitment to find another country, at least one, that they are gonna roll out this program into again, because it has been effective in Bangladesh. The Bangladesh Accord has been taken up by many, many agencies. So what I'd, um, I'd just really encourage you to do is to keep digging into the whole issue of what's happening in the textile and garment industry and do your part in it with, you know, just going beyond the sound bites, beyond the greenwashing, beyond all of this stuff. There's plenty of material out there to research. Um, the agency Clean Clothes campaign has actually, is actually a signatory on this uh, accord now. Rejoice in this because every single voice that has sent uh, an email, sent a text, tagged a company, every single person has been part of this wave going forward. And what we need to understand also is with a little humility really to recognize that this new accord did not just drop out of the sky Obviously, the people involved have wanted to continue this and they've been thrashing out behind the scenes how to do this. So our voices certainly have been part of the, the momentum to move it forward. But let us also be incredibly thankful for the people who've done really tough, hard negotiations behind the scenes to, to allow this new accord to come into place. So yeah, just get on board with it and really enjoy that we can move forward knowing that companies can be legally held responsible for the safety of people in the workplace creating all of our products. Thanks so much. Take good care. Bye now.